These are the instructions to install your front platform. To do this assembly, you're going to be using a four millimeter Allen wrench, which we provide, or you could use your own. And just a note, the machine is kind of heavy, so you may want a second set of hands to help you out in certain spots. Let's get started. First step is to remove the shipping plate. So to do that, you loosen each of these 10 screws about one full turn. Once you have them all loose, you simply lift the plate, then pull it back and remove it. You won't need this plate anymore. Next step is to install the bumpers onto the platform base. So to do that, you remove these two screws from the front. Slide the screw into the bumper and then reinstall into the same hole that it came out of. And repeat for the other side. The next step is to remove the travel stops. So you lift the platform all the way. Then you remove these two screws one at a time, pull it all the way out and the travel stop drops out. You will need to reinstall these, so keep them handy. Repeat for the other side. You can also let the travel stop simply fall and then pick it up. Next, you're going to install the platform onto the rail with these 10 screws and 10 holes. You slide the platform over the screw heads and set it down into place. You're going to fully extend the platform using these two clips just for the assembly to catch the platform and prevent it from dropping all the way forward. They work similar to a hood release, so you simply clip them over one side of the platform and onto the base. Repeat for the other side. And then you can release the platform all the way forward and it catches on these clips. Next up, we're going to release the spring. Simply lift up the pin and out of the slots. Then pop out the support arm and lay it down flat. Now we're ready to tighten these 10 bolts. Tighten all the bolts until they are fully firm and snugly tightened. Now we're going to install the two securing bolts into the base. Start them with your fingers and then tighten them down all the way. Next up, we're going to re-engage the support arm. Put the wheels all the way to the outside and then snap it in. Then we re-engage the spring by slotting the pin back into the two slots on either side. Now we're ready to lower the platform into the topmost position and reinstall the travel stops. So these travel stops, you want to make sure that you align this threaded hole with the opposing threaded or the opposing hole in the platform. Insert the screw and tighten it down. Then repeat that for the other side, but mirrored. Now you can remove your clips and your platform is fully installed.